this young man came to the emergency room tonight because uh, he has abdominal pain. The, the belly pain uh, was has been there for four days. Is that right? Uh -huh. And it's a, it's around his, his his belly button. Now you're you're a nurse, right? Yes. All right, good enough. Your mama. The pain is kind of different because it was around the belly button, and um, the pain was, was was more it was more painful when you urinate. Right, yeah, and I had kind of a fullness. And when I did the exam, like right over the bladder, it was painful to you when we pushed on it, right? And so, uh, but you've not had any uh, nausea or vomiting or, or diarrhea or anything like that going on at all. Okay, when you were hitting those speed bumps going uh, 90 miles an hour coming to the ER, did it hurt a little bit? Yeah, just slightly, slightly. Okay, why we want to talk about this is that on the CT scan, you actually had. Uh, uh, what's called an appendagitis, little fat globules that are sitting on your uh, colon that sometimes will twist. They're epiploic appendages, and it's not appendicitis, appendagitis. And basically, it's a, it's a necrosis or a death of these little fat globules, and they can cause significant pain and inflammation. And uh, it's just because they twist, they, they get torsed, I guess, you know, twist. And, and when they twist, they die, and you get local inflammation. And that's called appendagitis, which is not appendicitis, but it, but it can sure look like it. But it's, so it's relatively rare, and uh, it's probably even more rare in people your age, but it does happen in kids.